Thank you, Stephen. We're going to move over to our team coverage. We're going to join Max Massey, who's on his way to a jackknifed 18-wheeler that Stephen was just talking about a minute ago. What's the latest, Max? All right, guys. Well, I would say I'm usually calm, cool, and collected, especially while driving. It's been pretty crazy out there. You know, I live on the northwest side. Coming into work today, some hydroplaning, some frantic drivers, and then a lot of backsplash. You know, people driving in front of you and then getting what is left from them right under your windshield, and it throws you off a little bit. Made it to work safely. Now we're out and about here in the Storm Chaser, and I gotta say, we're now here on the west side, and we've seen a lot already. We've seen some 18-wheelers go a little bit too fast. We've seen some drivers, you know, trying to weave in and out of traffic. So if you are out and about, try to be safe. And then I'm gonna show you what we're looking at right now. Let's see if I can throw this on over to the roof cam. What we just saw was the aftermath of what appeared to be a high water rescue crews now leaving the scene but guys i gotta tell you a crazy story on the way over here we saw what i'm only going to describe as a local hero it appeared as though a older person was walking fell in the middle of the road because of the high water there and some man walked over and picked the person up and walked them over to the sidewalk and it didn't end there the guy then ran down the sidewalk and picked up the elder woman's uh, umbrella and then ran back all throughout the rain. So just, you know, crazy situations. But that is a, you know, a heroic situation that we found so far this morning. We're going to keep going out and about, like I just said, uh, taking another look out here. The fire truck is headed out, so they're done here. We're going to keep on the roads and if anything does pop up we're tracking flooding we're tracking high water rescues and we are tracking crashes and the only thing i can tell you guys is that if anyone hasn't left their home yet make sure to drive safe be smart a lot of following distance and watch out for those large puddles on the road guys all right max